What's your name? Gary Andrew Pallister. How old are you? 32. Where were you born? Ramsgate in Kent. What position do you play? Centre half. Probably need to be able to read the game. Um, obviously it helps if you're a little bit taller than most people um, for, the, for the aerial threats. And um, be strong in a tackle, I guess. Quick? Um, not necessarily. Steve Bruce wouldn't say that. I remember hooking a ball um, off the line against Middlesbrough in the semi-final of the Quarter Caller Cup, which when it was nil-nil with about ten minutes left, and um, it wasn't very well received in my hometown. <laughs> Wilkinson set her off. Hendry trying to get to it. Schmeichel committed. Hendry goalwards. Off the line by Gary Pallister. Saves Manchester United's bacon with a dramatic goal line clearance from John Hendry. Obviously, if things are sticking in your mind, it probably... Uh... The goals you score in your career, not just in your uh, mind, yeah. Like. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, you don't have that many to stick in there, right? But uh, yeah, more than you don't, you probably tend to forget tackles quite quickly, I suppose. The goal against Wrexham in the European Cup Winners' Cup, that was probably more enjoyable uh, than any other goal. It was a volley from just on the edge of the box, or maybe just inside the box. It gets further all the time, I can't remember. But it crashed into the roof of the net, so that one sticks in the memory. Sharp finding Webb. That's another teaser towards Steve Bruce. Good header under pressure. Gary Pallister, great goal! Oh, he enjoyed that. That's what to tell the grandchildren about one day. That'll get longer and longer with the passing of years. Not the best, but not the worst. What did the report say? Could do better. <laughs> uh, lazy, but could do better. He told everybody to, quiet, to be quiet, I think it was. It, we used to nickname him Bullet. So it tells you what type of geezer he was, an old-fashioned teacher. And uh, straight away, I just said, what day, I think I said it was something, what date is it, sir, or something like that. He said, right, get out of the palace, that's it, get out of the class. And uh, he caned me for that. So after I'm all the stuff I got, through, got away with through my school life, I actually got caned for asking what the date was. The team that won the first double was um, an exceptional side. I think um, the team we all thought was the best team at the time, I think they played together so many times and won every game. And uh, that was exciting. This team is, is playing some great football right now. Um, but if you'd asked me which was the best of the two, I'd find that one difficult to answer. I'd still probably have to plump for uh, Brian Robson. I think... Um, he epitomised what Manchester United was all about. He had the, the heart and the desire and the fight. And, um, you know, whenever he was in the team, he just, you know, it, uh, made you feel as though you, you were unbeatable. He was, um, uh, he was a legend. <laughs> Who are Pallister? I've always said it like, fits quite well. Um, maybe they'll try that one soon. Um, no, I think it's always been a difficult name to fit in somewhere. <laughs> um, I think I'm just stuck with that one without a shadow of a doubt, has to be the European Cup Winners' Cup in um, Rotterdam in 91. Um, the game was fantastic. We were the underdogs. Barcelona, I think, went on to win the European Cup the year after. They were expected to, uh, to wipe the floor with us, I think, and uh, we produced a great performance on the night. I think we had about three quarters of the stadium. The atmosphere was fantastic. It was a rainy night. Um, the passion from the supporters was unbelievable. Romario, for obvious reasons. He was good that night, wasn't he? He wasn't bad. It's hard work out there. Um, <laughs> now I've had a lot of people say that to me. I think it's just the way I am. It is, it is hard work and... Uh, you know, um, there's not a lot of smile about when you've got some of the players in the Premiership running at you. Um, but I, I do enjoy it, and uh, I certainly smile when we, uh, when we win things at the end of the season.